Are you ready to learn some frog foo? So am I. I'm Callie Lewis. Welcome to Geeky. Feet. I have a special demo for you guys with Tim and Courtney. Thanks for joining me. Thank you thank, for having us. Yes, thank you. <laughs> so you guys are with Inspire Games. Yes. And you just recently launched a Kickstarter project for a special app um, called Pad Defender. Yes. That's right. So what is Pad Defender? Uh, well, Pad Defender is a game for kids that teaches them how to type, basically, because you know how everybody needs to type, or it's somebody not just for kids. Somebody has to learn at some either. point. Yeah, wait, exactly. it's for like people like me who can't type whatsoever, and oh, do you do now. the two finger thing like me? Oh yeah, I don't, yeah. I don't even know how to finger type. <laughs> <laughs> so, so it's both for kids and adults. So you're yes. trying to kind of make it easy for everybody, but also it seems like. Really, one of your goals is to to make learning fun. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Definitely, because we're we're trying to uh, bring back the golden era from basically not too long ago. I guess. The 90s. <laughs> yeah. She's trying not 90s. to. The 90s. I guess. I guess she doesn't it, want it to reveal the nineties. But uh, you're not when, that old. <laughs> not yet. Uh, when but when games were when games were actually really prominent in classroom environments and right. actually even at home games were prominent with lots of learning stuff attached to them yeah educational and so, stuff and and lots of kids actually just loved those games and they always pl they played them and they learned stuff inadvertently which was great but then eventually the gaming part got taken out and now there's just boring learning so yeah. <laughs> we think teachers freaked out and they were like oh no they, you can't learn and have fun so they kind of pulled a lot of the fun games out now they well, have that's the way that. people learn best is to exactly. enjoy the process exactly yeah so that's what we're doing we, we're, we're making this game that's got a lot of different challenges and boss mobs and boss mobs yeah, yeah boss mobs and you gotta and you can level up and you can unlock things you know it's like it's like a common game that they play nowadays like okay. all the graphics and stuff are on par with everything nowadays but um it teaches them how to type so okay. and they love it too and now you are in charge of the graphics yes. and you're the developer yes so um she's you... awesome <laughs> no, he's the awesome one i just i just stare at lines of code all day <laughs> <laughs> both of you are awesome it takes special kind of people to do both of these jobs um <laughs> but you know one of the things that i do love about uh about the game and i haven't seen it in action yet mm -hmm. but I, I do love the graphics uh you have a special talent for that oh, thank you. so congratulations on making a beautiful game oh thank you <laughs> um but let's take a look so you okay. want to teach me how to do it like is it is it going to be hard no, it's do not, i it's if i can't at all okay <laughs> it's, it's, meant, it's meant to start you to be basically a platform that somebody of any typing skill level can uh, just pick up okay. and start playing. So if you're brand new, new typing user. or if you're already an excellent typist. All right, I boring. guess I'll just start typing here, Callie. And these yeah. are just a uh, placeholder UI, by the way. We're still messing around with the UI and everything. So. The, speaking of which, the Kickstarter project is, is in action right now. And people yes. can yeah. fund yes. it and get a copy of the game and some other stuff, right? Right, yeah. exactly. In fact, the Kickstarter is geared towards um, teachers and PTA and stuff to where oh, okay. if they donate a certain amount, we'll give copies to like whole classrooms or oh. whole schools or whole yeah. grades. That's you great. Know, to yeah. really teach them so everybody can get involved with it. That's fantastic. Yes. I like that. <laughs> All right, so uh, level select. Yes. All right. So I think I ought to start at stage one. <laughs> we should definitely start. You know, Did you stage put it one. on easy? Oh. Yeah, put it on <laughs> easy for me, please. Are you sure you don't want to do it with your heart? <laughs> do whatever you want. <laughs> you tell me. <laughs> let's let's put it on medium. It's okay. Like good, it's good intermediate. All right. As you can see, uh -oh. it tracks all, everything like your uh, words per minute and accuracy and everything like that. In yeah. fact, that's we're going to put that in the Kickstarter so where we can make reporting for teachers and schools and stuff so they can yeah. keep track of the kids. And oh, that's the, yeah, also, I love that that gearing towards the the actual student um, teachers and students. Oh wait, what am I so, supposed to do? So what you'll, <laughs> do, you'll see bugs fly onto the screen and you'll just start typing the letters above their heads. Yeah. <laughs> 
A L D L. And as you type, you see the letters will light up, and once you've completed the ah! word, <laughs> yeah. get the, the pressure green is on. Get the green Perhaps we should have explained this before we just yeah, started. probably. <laughs> But no, you know what? I, I understood what I was supposed to do as soon as I saw it. It's just a matter of actually doing it while trying to... There wow, you go. the Green noises. Bunch. Okay, I'm getting better at this. <laughs> F-J-A. It's, I don't know where these things are. <laughs> okay, so... That's, we're actually... One, one thing that we're planning on implementing is having uh, part of the UI off to the side here actually show you which letter you're typing to help Ooh, it uh, promote... <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Power up. Okay, so what's what's the difference between uh, I see? You know, sometimes I'm gonna get a horrible store score. But um, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Here, let's pause. Okay, the what's the difference look, between? <laughs> nice. <laughs> there are some actual words and then mm -hmm. just some letters. What's mm -hmm. the rhyme and reason behind that? Um, for the first couple of letters, I'm level. <laughs> for the first couple of levels because. What we're actually planning on doing is taking the keyboard and starting you off in like the home row position okay. and then eventually gradually adding more and more keys so that it actually helps promote the proper hand placement for touch oh, typists. Okay. Um, and so based on that, we only had a certain, the, the true reasoning behind it is there was only a certain amount of letters and there's only so many words you can make with so many letters. <laughs> so we added some gibberish in, but at the same time we decided that Adding the gibberish in would also promote learning where the keys were as mm -hmm. opposed to learning just how the to words. type certain words. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. And we so. took all the bad words out. Yes, okay. we did filter. <laughs> well, we did specifically look teachers. for bad words okay. and filter them out. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> so, so you won't say, I don't know what I can say on this show. So Yeah, let's not go there. <laughs> There's a lot of slurs and things that, and curse words that you won't see. Okay. You won't Fantastic. See. Yeah. So, uh, is that, is what I just did my frog foo? Yes. yes. Is that Those what it's the called? The combos and stuff you get, like, multiply your score. And the, the more you type without making mistakes, the higher the multiplier is. So, you get, at the very end, it adds everything up, and that's how you get the really high scores. Nice. And the UI's not in yet, but it'll show all that when okay. we get that built yeah. in. In fact, I just finished last night a bunch of UI. The, <laughs> yeah, it looks, it looks really everything. awesome. It's very oh, colorful. <laughs> <laughs> to put it in but yeah and, and we're also planning on adding other certain other features like uh showing which which key you've pressed uh okay. so that that way you don't have to look down at your at your fingers so much as just look over and say oh i just pressed an f so you know in for future so you know reference for, yeah so what muscle you're memory then exactly you, then you can get it yeah. Um, and then, you know, one thing we I, I, we didn't even uh, go into is the story behind the app itself. Why frogs? Why these flies? Why frog foo? <laughs> you want to tell the story of <laughs> the three frogs? The fr three friends? Go for it, the three frogs? Okay. Yeah. Once upon a time, there were three <laughs> little frogs, Niblet, Tidbit, and Roke. Aww. <laughs> and they were playing leapfrog one day in the swamp because that's frog's favorite game of course play, it is of course and this frog food master named blarney yes. stepped into their path blarney will be your trainer throughout the game oh uh, okay yeah he, he's gonna pop up like clippy nice yeah. i love clippy uh, so he interrupted their game and he said hey guys do you want to learn frog food and then he taught them. <laughs> well, I am thankful that I have now learned frog foo. <laughs> this is actually really intuitive. Like I said, I pretty much understood what I was supposed to do right when it started. Yeah. So yeah. congrats on that. That's fantastic. You Thank guys you. can go fund the game and help them launch it and get uh, get it going at Kickstarter. Yeah. Uh, or just padwithfender.com, right? Yep. Right. Right, and we got the um, we basically had the first five levels finished, and okay. th there's a whole progression to the story. Like you find out why the swamp's being taken over by mutant bugs and stuff. Nice. So yep. we've got the first five levels, but we want to add another five, and then we even take it farther because it's a lot of fun. The kids we put on it really want to play it, and every time yeah. we come out with a new level, they're they're asking us, "When's the new level coming out? We want to play it again." You know. Yep. So it's addicting, is what yes. you're telling me. Exactly. Addicting to addicting. learning. Yep. Addicted yep. to learning. <laughs> <laughs> yep. It's, okay. it's, yeah. 
<laughs> it just reminds me whenever I, whenever I do something weird that's not necessarily bad, I always tell my dad, "Well, there's worse things I could be doing." And so it's just like this. It's your par- your parent the parents will see, you know, the kids are playing games, but then they see, "Oh, well, they're learning a skill." And yeah. I mean, there's worse things your kids could be learning from a game. Yeah, my <laughs> so. my uh, sister tends to limit my nephew's, you know, time on devices, but I think I could get her to pass and it's some extra time if he's actually learning and going through this uh, skill learning process. So, right. Yeah. Yeah, that's why we started. Is I, uh, my son brought home games and he yeah. was playing that were assigned to him and they were just horrible games. And he was like, I don't want to play those. I want to yeah. go play, you know, Call of Duty and whatnot and shoot people <laughs> in the head. And I'm like, I got to make something fun that he can learn from. So that's, yeah, that's what personal. Inspire is about. Yeah. yeah. And, Fantastic. And we really want to prove that this works like that that's one of the reasons for keeping track of all the high scores and wanting to do all the reporting Mm -hmm. is once we prove that the formula actually really does work then we can have people be more accepting of it and so i think that's really what we're setting out to do in these early stages and i mean i have to say so far the results have been really great because i know i've been the one to play it the most because i have to fix everything (laughs) but I actually so you've become a better greatly typer. Greatly improved my typing. I was not bad because I program all the time, but yeah. I've actually gone from having an average of you know fifty five words per minute to seventy. So wow, and greater accuracy. So I was actually quite surprised and excited. Impressive. To see this, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much. You guys can help them prove that learning can be fun at paddefender.com. Tim, Courtney, you guys are awesome. Thank Thank you. you. Thank you. Give us a thumbs up on YouTube. Two if you got them. I'm Callie. Bye.